Okay, this drill is called the heavy ball. You can see that what we've done is we've taken the camera off the stand and down here at court level, and I have it looking right down the baseline. So let me define for you what heavy ball is. A heavy ball is, for the sake of this drill, is any ball that when it crosses this baseline, it's coming this way, if it crosses this baseline and it's going up, that's a heavy ball, okay? And that's what your goal is. So I got two players rallying on a half a court, two more on this other half, and when you're on this side, you're just receiving these balls. Every time that you think the ball is rising, you're going to say one, two, and you're going to basically race. You guys are racing you guys. To see if you can get up to 10 rising, okay? Let's try it and see what it looks like. Okay, count it out loud, guys. So here's what this drill is supposed to teach. One. I use it a lot with kids who hit hard, maybe a little bit too hard. They're overly aggressive because the toughest ball is not necessarily a really hard ball that comes and lands in the strike zone of the opponent. Um, this is a ball that Rafa uh, Nadal is very familiar with. He sends this ball all the time. He hits it higher and with a lot of spin and deep and that's what makes it deadly. Okay, so it's just a new way to look at it, what a good quality shot is. Most kids are going to default, or rec players for that matter, a good shot to them is if it's hard and if it's in. And this is a, a different way to look at it, I think a little more mature way. Uh, you want to make sure that ball lands deep and it's pushing the guy back. So you'll see in some of the editing that we do here, sometimes the ball is on the rise and the line's important because that's the line that we're measuring. It's what's it doing when it crosses this baseline right here. Right? Players on that side will learn quickly that if they just wail on the ball with low neck clearance, even if it's hard, it won't be rising over here. What makes the ball rise is depth and initial arc over the net. And a lot of spin will help as well. Okay? So it's a little bit uh, a ball that maybe a junior wouldn't appreciate as much, but when they're on the receiving end of it, they realize how tough it is. And again, if you want to think of a person that deploys this all the time, Think of uh, Rafa Nadal. He has this ball down pat. It often lands deep in here, and the majority of his balls, when they clear the baseline, are on the rise. Okay, so the game is called heavy ball. That's what we call it. And you have a little competition, two players versus another two players. The players here have to be honest. They're calling their partner shots. And uh, as soon as somebody gets to 10, that's the winner of the game. And then you make sure you switch in so that both players have a chance to work on it.